Hello there, my name is Evangelist Epsiba Amos, and we are still talking on, uh, we are still talking about strategic praying. You know, there are some people who experience constant attacks. There are people who experience challenges all the time. Like I would always say, yes, you got to pray without ceasing, but a lot of people find it so difficult to keep doing this all the time praying without ceasing now if you are going to be strategizing your prayer in order to be able to defeat the enemies that has been troubling your life you must learn to understand the watch hours of prayer it's very important now we talk about praying without ceasing there are thousands of us that knows how to pray always as i'm seated now i'm praying if i'm walking i'm praying whatever i'm doing i'm praying but still that doesn't mean that i do not strategize my prayers sometimes now following the watches of prayers it helps a lot yes it helps a lot we have eight watch hours of the day eight watch hours of the day when it comes to pray i can assure you that there are time there are time that's tiny in prayer that when you can you know discipline yourself enough to pray at some particular time the enemies will not be able to have access into your life yet it may sound like what's this one saying but believe you me is the truth I would like to say that this particular episode, I'm trying to encourage people that experience attacks all the time. They experience attack at every given time. Any slight opportunity, any time that they felt, oh, I want to relax, the next thing is an attack. Negative dream, one attack or the other, Romance in the dream, eating in the dream, fighting in the dream. And when you wake up, you start experiencing things that you did not back in for. I would like to teach you how to strategize your prayer. It is very key. You know how to fight your battle strategically. You know, the Bible told us the story of Prophet Abacom. That was a prophet of God that experienced tough times in his time. He experienced terrible challenges in his time that he had to cry out to God and ask God, how long will you allow this affliction, this iniquities to continue in my life? Then later on, he said to himself in Habakkuk chapter 2 verse 1, I will wait upon my watch and see what the Lord has to say. You need to understand the importance of watch hours is very key watch hours there are times there are there are timing in prayer there are timing in prayer sometimes that tackles some particular events in our lives yeah that's one thing I want to start teaching people if you have been experiencing repeated challenges if it seems as though you have prayed and prayed and the challenge still continues, please stay tuned to this program, Mirror Talk with FC. I'm going to be coming up with how you can strategize your prayers because it is very important. And one of our abilities as believers of Jesus Christ is the ability to pray. Pray without ceasing. If you are the type that don't even remember to pray without ceasing, when you're walking on the road, you can even remember to pray. When you're seated, you don't remember to pray. Strategize yourself. Learn how to program your time during the watch hours. Even if it has to be 30, 30 minutes on each watch hour of the day, you will benefit so much from it. Thank you very much for listening. Just expect my next video because I'm going to start talking about the watch hours of the day. God bless you. Bye for now.